Welcome to Paisley Abbey's Daily Prayer for Monday, the 20th of April. Christ has risen, he has risen indeed, alleluia, alleluia. Let us pray. Blessed are you, God our Father, who have raised Jesus from the dead. Keep us firm in the faith that Jesus is our Lord and our God. May we encounter him in our everyday lives and live in his peace. Open our eyes to see his scars in those who suffer and inspire us through your spirit to bring them comfort, consolation and hope. In the name of the same, Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. A reading from the letter to the Colossians, chapter 1, a wonderful passage on the divine nature of Christ. Jesus Christ is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn of all creation. For in him all things in heaven and on earth were created, things visible and invisible. For the thrones or dominions or rulers or powers, all things have been created through him and for him. He himself is before all things, and in him all things hold together. He is the head of the body, the church. He is the beginning, the firstborn from the dead, so that he might come to a first place in everything. For in him all the fullness of God was pleased to dwell, and through him God was pleased to reconcile to himself all things, whether on earth or in heaven, by making peace through the blood of his cross. Here ends the reading. Let us pray. Almighty and eternal God, the strength of those who believe and the hope of those who doubt, may we, who have not seen, have faith and receive the fullness of Christ's blessing, who is alive and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Risen Christ, for whom no door is locked, no entrance barred, open the doors of our hearts, that we may seek the good of others and walk the joyful road of sacrifice and peace to the praise of God the Father. Amen. And let us say together the family prayer of the Church. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. God the Father, by whose glory Christ was raised from the dead, strengthen you to walk with him in his risen life. And the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, be among you and remain with you forever. Amen. Our time together today ends with George, the Abbey's Director of Music, playing another of Bach's Easter preludes. <laughs>